Hey guys, how's it going? Today, I'm going to be showing you guys the best agents to solo queue with in Valorant. So this top five list comes from our competitive team. Make sure you guys go show them some love and support because without them, this video wouldn't be possible. But before we get into it, make sure you guys drop a like and make sure to hit that subscribe button because we're almost at 2000 subscribers and we would really appreciate it if you guys could help us out. But anyways, let's get into it. So solo queuing is a lot harder than having friends to play with or just generally having a five stack. And that's because, you know, you're with a bunch of random people from all over the world and a lot of times they're not just communicating with you they're kind of doing weird plays and stuff like that and sometimes it can be really really hard to carry a certain team if you're not running the right operator for the job so in this video we're going to be going over which agents you want if you need to go frag heavy and what agents you want if you want to play more of a support role so starting off with the fragging agents the top one is going to be reyna and this is because reyna you are a like well skilled mechanical player you'll be able to use reyna very effectively because she is a very momentum based character and once you get the ball rolling with kills then you'll be able to quickly turn the match into your favor and just overall generally she's a kind of a lone wolf when it comes to uh playing her because really she just depends on your actual skill level and your ability to hit your shots and if you guys aren't that confident with your uh, mechanics or your aim then you're gonna want to probably pick raise she's a way easier opera to use her loadout and her utility is just so strong that she's able to get picks easily and clear certain areas areas of the map and just full on be super aggressive and this is mainly because she's the only agent in the game with an actual grenade and a you know <laughs> rocket launcher so playing her is it's going to take a little less skill to play her than reyna for example but both of them are, are very good picks when it comes to frag agents and quickly before we get into the support agent list kinetics is, is actually doing a giveaway we're going to be giving away two kovac steam keys so if you guys are looking to improve your aim and you've been using aim labs but you know you don't really have the money or you can't really get kovacs then we'll be giving away two of those keys so make sure you guys actually click that link in the description below to enter the giveaway anyways back to it i'm moving into the support category uh support is basically just you're supporting your team being able to play these agents very well and effectively is going to uh, make you a lot better player because when you're solo queuing everybody just usually wants to go the frag ops because the frag ops tend to be the most enjoyable and all your job is as a frag op is basically just get kills whereas when you're a support player it actually takes planning and strats and coordination so i would suggest putting some time into the support operators because because it will pay off when you get good with them for the first support operator is going to be sage sage is so helpful to a team because she has the ability to heal herself heal her teammates and resurrect somebody and she also has the ability to basically block off any place she wants and deny entry for at least a couple seconds and when you're solo queuing this is very helpful because it gives your time to rotate to you and help you out and stop in the push and for the second support character is going to be brimstone brimstone is very useful because you usually always want smokes on a team lineup to be able to block off lines of sight of certain areas because there's just so many angles if they get a couple rounds off you the defenders are just going to hold the sights with a bunch of ops with deep angles and that can be really hard to deal with if you don't have smokes so learning how to play brim will be very useful when you uh, encounter that situation or you just want to full-on push into a site and for the last and final agent for support is going to be breach now breach's utility makes him one of the most unique agents in the game in my opinion because he has multiple abilities to stop the plant in almost any situation and to get somebody out of a specific spot with his kill shot ability and if you combine the kill shot and his flashes and you use them right then you're going to be very successful in your engagements and most likely win the game but anyways guys that's it for the video let me know if you guys enjoy it let me know if you guys actually disagree and actually have a different top five agent list and let me know your thoughts on this one but anyways guys i'll see you later Hold on. Good job, I see. Window, 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 window. I, dude, I whipped every bullet. I gotta grab my gun, they're saving. Right above the second. Okay, okay, Saber. Got one, got one, uh, C. They're in, one's in garage. Yo, they go to their top garage by, by our spawn side, you know? Gunners. Any help? Coming, coming, going. Where last? One enemy remaining. Alright, fuck off. Get your ace. Where? I don't know. I'm gonna bait myself. Oh, he's in our spawn, bro.